everybody, this is CLR Gaming. If you're new here, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. It's good to have you guys. And welcome to another episode of Phasmophobia. Why? Why am I doing this? Why am I playing this game? I don't know. I don't know. I'm scared. I'm a scaredy cat. But I love the detective aspect of it. So here we are, doing something I'm scared to do. Hey, that was pretty good. I've been uh, playing some of these games upstairs. You gotta go way high. Oh! No way! Ah! Look at that, guys! Yeah, I think I'm good. We can go. We can leave. <laughs> they have some games here to help you with the controls because they are a little weird uh, to get used to. And I, since I play so many games, I, uh, I forget. You know I forget. It is still Christmas. I think they're going to let it go on for one more week. And then there's going to be an update next week and get rid of all of it. Look at this crime scene. <laughs> Didn't realize that in the last episode. Speaking of the last episode, we did great. We did our very first, we, well, we did the training and we survived, luckily enough. And then we did our very first house at Tanglewood. And after a while, we were able to identify the right ghost. Our first ghost ever was an obake. So that's exciting. We also were able to unlock the camera. That's what I was looking at before I started recording. So I tried to put that in our loadout and I think I was able to do that. And we unlocked two new maps. We unlocked Edgefield and Ridgeview. So let's just go in order and do Edgefield. I'm not too familiar with any of the houses so I guess it doesn't matter too much. And I think that's everything. We have one of each. We could add another video camera if we wanted. I believe it's 50 bucks. Can I? Oh, I don't quite understand this. I think there's a basic loadout, which is one of everything. All right, I'll meet you guys over there. All right, here we are. A cursed object? No, 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 no. All right, so we are here on the case of Heather Walker. I don't think we looked at the name of the last ghost, did we? A response to people who are alone. Capture a photo of the ghost. These are like extra objectives you could do if you're feeling like doing 100% completion. I just don't want to die. And then this is the layout of the house. It looks like it's a two-story. Oh god, this one is so much bigger than Tanglewood. Okay, I'm going to take the thermometer because that'll help us locate the ghost. What else should we take with us? A flashlight because it's going to be dark. And I guess we can set up the camera, look for some orbs, grab the key, and open the door. I haven't played this in a few days, so let's see how much we remember. It is so dark today. What is going on? Oh, I forgot you have to hold it down. Uh, is the breaker on? It is not on in this one. See, in Tanglewood it was on. So now we gotta try and find the breaker. Oh god, I'm gonna... Don't be scared. Strong, independent female. Ah, the creaky stairs didn't scare us. Too bad. Where does one put the breaker? Oh, this is so creepy. Oh, there it is. Jeez. Hello? There we go. I feel like they upped the difficulty by a lot from Tanglewood to this one. It's so dark. Okay. Um, is one of these open? We can hide down here. Sanity's going to be dropping like crazy. I don't even know where the light switches are. Okay. Let's take out the thermometer and start looking. And there's another door here? 
<laughs> Ooh, little snowman. You scared me. Okay, we got another hiding place in here. Okay. It's good to know. I'm worried about tripping the breaker. The kitchen? Laundry room is scary. Okay, we're going upstairs because it, what the hell is that? Oh, the, the bathroom. It in here because he turned it on. What the hell? Oh no 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 no! Oh wait! Oh uh, see! Oh! 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 Turn turn that off. Well, why is there water still running? Yes, it's fair enough to say that this is the ghost room. I didn't like those red lights at all. Is there another bathroom? Let's turn this light on because, uh, it's like a kid's room. It. This one is very active uh, compared to the last one. Oh my god, she's still doing stuff. I'm gonna go down <laughs> and uh, change my pants. Good grief, dude. Our sanity's 25, I mean 25, 75 already. Ooh, man. Uh, let's see if we can see some orbs. I'm gonna hang out here for a minute. Well, I didn't see any orbs, and it looks like she knocked the camera down. This Heather lady is nuts. Okay, our sanity's going up a little bit from being in the truck. I kind of want to get... Uh, An EMF reader. Oh boy. We gotta find some place to hide upstairs. What are you doing in here? Let's see if we can get a reading of five. Oh god! <gasps> Oh, that looked like a five, didn't it? Oh, yeah. This, this, bitch, this lady. Go, go, go. Why is my heart still beating? Get out of here. Oh, my God. Whew. 50. <laughs> this one is so aggressive. Okay, hold on. Be right back. Okay, guys, we are back. I, well, you never left, huh? I had to go cook dinner and uh, bring my heart rate down. But I am back, and I'm trying to figure out where I left off. Heaven help us. Okay, so we did get evidence while we were there. EMF of five. This thing is crazy, right? I feel like there's a ghost. Our sanity went down like 20%, but it did walk through us. Let me see something. Okay, so when we came into this... God, that thing is crazy. 
When we came in, our sanity was like 75. It walked through us and it went down, what, 20%? And there is a ghost, an Oni, during any form of ghost event, deducts 20% sanity instead. And Oni is one of the ones on here. Let's look up Oni. It could be a long shot, but this ghost is scaring the shit out of me and I don't want to go in there again. I don't have to. I mean, we'll go in one more time. Huh, freezing temperatures, that would be easy to get. And dots, dots is not that easy for me to get. They're much more active whilst people are nearby and will drain their sanity faster when manifesting. Oni disappears less often while hunting their prey. Onis love to scare their victims as much as possible before attacking. They are often seen in their physical form, guarding their place of death. Man, I really feel like it's an Oni. And I don't have anything to increase my sanity. I, I, let's let's go in there. I gotta get my big girl panties on. It's gonna hunt us. Uh, I'm trying to get my dots. Hello? There we go. If it's freezing temperature... I'm gonna drop that too. This thing's gonna kill me. I don't wanna die. I'm too young to die. Okay. Listen. Where can I go? I can go here, right? I can go there. Okay. Oh. It is freezing temperatures. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> Holy shit. It is so cold in there. Look how cold it was in there. Eh? Look at your girl. She's a detective. Get the hell out of here. Oni. It's got to be an Oni. This one is so, so aggressive. Let's go. I'm not taking pictures. I'm not... No. I have to change my diapers is what I gotta do. Goodbye, camera. If it's not that, I'm just packing up and leaving. <laughs> Girls, a detective. A detective, people. She dropped our sanity so much. Yeah, we didn't get bone. No, listen, that one was scary. And we got the right one. Look at it. We leveled up. Farmhouse. Please don't. Two farmhouses. I don't know about that. All right. That was pretty good. We used our detective skills to figure out that our sanity dropped 20%. And I remember reading about a ghost that would drop your sanity by a lot. All right. We're doing it, people. And I only got scared a lot in that one. I hated that one completely. So different from our first one. So you can see how the different ghosts act differently. And hopefully we can learn their mannerisms and behaviors and become better detectives but for now that's gonna do it for this one i appreciate y'all watching you have a good one stay safe and until the next time bye oh boy stupid only play a game calm my nerves that's what i'm gonna do oh, i'm a cornhole master